We are northwest of Fort Worth, minutes from Denton, Texas, where a small town is growing by leaps and bounds. This area is what I would describe as a small country town, you know, Western heritage mixed with big city sophistication. Today, we're going to take a close look at Timberbrook and Justin, Texas. Are you ready? Hi, I'm Tracy Sorrell with the DFW Life, and I help people just like you sell and buy homes in and around our Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex. And I realize you can get a lot of information online, you know, bedrooms, square feet, baths, even the price. But what you may not be able to discover is how people really live their lives. Well, that's where I come in. I hop in the car, I drive around, and I share with you. I give you the VIP bird's eye view of how people really live their lives in our different cities, communities, and suburbs. And if you like that VIP treatment, then you're going to want to subscribe below, press the bell, and be notified anytime anything goes down around our DFW Metroplex. Oh, and don't forget, give us a thumbs up. In this video, we're gonna cover three important things, things that you want to know whenever you're getting ready to make your move into a new city, community, a suburb. We're going to look at the three builders who can build you your dream home. We're gonna discuss why now may be the best time for you to make your move. And the third thing is the things you can do in and around this community. But now, let's get the show on the road. first builder is Impression Homes. This is a four bedroom, three bath home with about 2664 square feet. It's the Hampton floor plan. You also have a beautiful office, great primary suite with access to the laundry room through your primary closet. And I know that's become very, very popular. Comment below and let me know if this home feels like the perfect place for you. If Impression Homes is your builder of choice, they can create your dream home from 14 floor plans. You can have three to five bedrooms, 1,400 to 3,600 square feet, and price ranges 
from 386,000 up to 485,000. Now that's just entry. That's the base model, just get through the door. But if you do your upgrades, which I'm sure many of you will, then you're looking at a price of around, well, a little bit more than $500,000. One of the things that I think you can appreciate about impression homes is that they are on the more affordable scale in comparison to the other two builders. So you can get into Timberbrook at a much more affordable price. Before you pick your lot, here are a few things that will matter to you. You can build your home on a 60, 65, 70, or 80 foot wide lot, and there will be nine phases in about 1,300 homes upon completion of this neighborhood. If you want one with a view of the green space and the trees, you may want to hit pause and give me a call right away. At the beginning of the video, I mentioned that now may be the best time for you to make your move, and this is why. Many builders are publicly traded companies and with the responsibility to show profit to shareholders. Typically, at the end of each quarter, especially the end of the year, can be the perfect combination to get you a great deal. Let's connect and we can cover more details about the different times of year that you can get a sweet deal. If you think having a one-story home feels about right, well, take a look at this one-story Caraway by Bloomfield Homes. This home is a three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath. It's very comfortable at about 25, 1900 square feet, possibly the perfect size for you. What do you think? In case you need a little bit more room to roam, Bloomfield can offer you a two-story home. This one is the Seabury. It's a four-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath, about 3,478 square feet. It has a great office space, great kitchen with butler's pantry, 
and walk-in pantry. If you have a home this size, chances are you are making multiple trips to the store. As you can see here, you can stock up in this pantry for all your hungry people. And finally, retreat upstairs to your nice loft, three bedrooms, three full baths. What are your thoughts? Comment and let me know. If Bloomfield Homes feels more like your builder, well, here is your snapshot. Bloomfield can build you a beautiful home for more than 15 different floor plans, nearly 20. The square feet ranges from around 1,840 to up to 4,226. They can create you a three bedroom or all the way up to a five bedroom, two to four and a half baths, up to three car garage. Now, as far as price, you're looking at an introductory price of about $417,000, and it can go all the way up to nearly $700,000, depending on your upgrades. And if you have really nice taste, then you're probably going to end up having your home price more than $700,000. Although Sandlin Homes was not open when I was in the community, I do know that they can build you a beautiful home. I've had clients in their homes. Sandlin Homes here in Timberbrook can create your home from 12 other floor plans. You can choose up to five bedrooms, up to three and a half full baths, three car garage option, and as far as square feet, around 2,061 square feet up to around 3,823 square feet. Now the price, your introductory price is going to be around 459,000 up to 604,000. But just like with any other builder, the more upgrades you have, the more it will cost. Building a dream home and it's gonna be beautiful, but I have a sneaky suspicion that at some point you're gonna open the front door lift the garage, get out and explore the things to do around your neighborhood. So we're gonna tackle, we're gonna explore. I'm gonna share with you the fun things that you can enjoy in and around Timberbrook and Justin, Texas. There are so many things to do in Timberbrook that I don't think you would ever need to leave your community, but I'm sure at some point you will. But let's take a look at the things that you can do inside your neighborhood. Well, for one, there are several playgrounds. You have great parks, the dog park, I mean, it's almost second to none in that the dogs have so much room to roam over there in the dog park. There's a pool, there's a plan for a second pool, pickleball, volleyball, outdoor pavilion, and the trails that wind around your community. And you saw earlier where you have so many beautiful views on your walking trails. And there is a plan for an elementary school to be right in the community. Speaking of schools being in the community, your students will attend the award-winning Northwest ISD Independent School District. In Northwest ISD, there are 23 elementary schools and three high schools. Niche.com gives Northwest ISD a grade A. 
There are more than 30,000 students who attend Northwest ISD, so it's a pretty large school district, but it's really great to know that large can feel really manageable and intimate, especially when you have an elementary school right there in your neighborhood. Oh, and another great thing about living in Timberbrook is if your parents are thinking about living near you but not with you, then Ladera Living is opening up a community inside of Timberbrook. Ladera Living is a 55 plus active community and it will be right there in the same neighborhood. So here's the beauty of it. Your parents will live near you. And if you play your cards right, they may do a limited babysitting for you. So they're planning to break ground uh, for Ladera Living there in Timberbrook sometime in 2025. Well, if you're feeling a little bit more adventurous and decide to leave your community of Timberbrook, which I'm sure you will at some point, then you're going to want to take a look around at the things to do in and around the city of Justin. First, Justin Discount Boots and Outfitters, which is just right around the corner from you, less than a mile from you. And this is a great place to go and just go inside of it. Even if you don't like cowboy boots and Western wear, just go inside to get a grasp of so much rich history that it has of the city of Justin. You'll see history on the walls. You'll see memorabilia. It's a really, really cool place to go. So you absolutely have to go there. And why wouldn't you? It's right around the corner from where you live. And you might be thinking, whoa, is this the Justin Boots? Well, they have a loose relationship, but the Justin Boots, that's actually in the city of Fort Worth. Let's say you're playing a nice, friendly game of Trivia Pursuit, well, Ponder, Texas may have one of the answers. In Ponder, Texas, the notorious Bonnie and Clyde are said to have robbed the bank there in Ponder. And if you're really on a winning streak with Trivia Pursuit, someone may throw a wild card out there and ask you about the city of Dish. Yes, it is true. The city of Dish, which is just about three miles from Justin, is actually named after Dish Network. And there's a whole story behind that and we've already done a video on the history of Dish. And if you're feeling like a nice game of golf, six miles away is the golf club at Champion Circle. And one of our famous Texas landmarks is Bucky's. And Bucky's is only seven miles away from Justin. Texas Motor Speedway, if you have a need for speed, is only seven miles away, right across the road, right across the street from Bucky's. And near Bucky's, we have the Outlet Mall, Tanger Outlet Mall. So there's quite a few things that you can do near Justin and near your community. But if you feel like straying away just a little bit farther, guess what? You can score tickets to see in person as a studio guest Dr. Phil, and his studio is only 12 miles away. And if you feel like a little lake life, Lake Grapevine is only 18 miles away. And of course, Lake Grapevine, that is where you're going to enjoy the water on your boat, jet skis, have a picnic on the beach. There's so much fun to be had there at Lake Grapevine. You can also go horseback riding at some of the points. So there's a lot of fun to be had. And I know you're going to spend the whole day over there at the lake. Now, let's say you want to venture into some of our outlining cities just for the fun of it. The city of Denton is only 17 miles away from your home. Denton is where we have the University of North Texas, Texas Women's University, and the downtown Denton area is really cute and charming. You absolutely are going to want to take just a quick drive, just a few minutes, 17 miles away, and explore the city of Denton. Well, there's no way you're not going to explore Fort Worth or Dallas. I mean, after all, it's the DFW Metroplex. So to put things in perspective, when you really feel adventurous, here's Justin, Texas, and you are only... 26 miles from the city of Fort Worth. And Fort Worth has one of the nationally acclaimed, in fact, the top tier zoo in the entire country. Fort Worth is so filled with history and sophistication. It's where our Western history begins. But when we say Western, it is filled with a lot of wealth, the art, the museums, the shopping, Sundance Square, 7th Street, the, the stockyards. And of course, as I say, that's where the real live cowboys own real live horses driving real live cattle down to the stockyards. So that's really a sight to see. 
And if you're really feeling adventurous, about 43 miles to the city of Dallas. And Dallas, well, let's just say anything you could think of doing or want to do, you could probably find it in the city of Dallas, where there's tons of museums, shopping, sophistication, quite a diverse population. All cultures are there, fine dining, casual dining. I mean, both Dallas and Fort Worth, you can really enjoy eating at places that you've seen featured on some of the most exclusive dining television shows. So those are just a few things you can do and explore in and around your community. Now for a public service announcement. And if you've watched any of my other videos, you already know the answer. Now to answer the question that many of you may have, because I hear this quite often, and that is, hey Tracy, do I need to use a realtor if I'm buying a brand new home? And my answer to you is yes. And this is why. When you go into the builder's model home, you are greeted by some really warm, friendly salespeople. Those people actually work for the builder. Therefore, they represent the builder and what's in the best interest or fiduciary duty to their client. Don't you deserve the same level of advocacy while you are looking to build your dream home? Because there's so much more involved with a home than just the elevation the floor plan, the option. You need someone who's looking out for you, who's got your back from start to finish, even in new construction. Hi, I'm Tracy Sorrell with the DFW Life, and I help people just like you sell and buy homes in and around our Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex. And if you're thinking about making Timberbrook your next place or anywhere in our Metroplex, do me a favor, comment below, give me a call, grab one of those one-on-one -on -one consultation links so we can set up a Zoom time to better discover if Timberbrook or one of our other communities is the best place for you to create your new memories and call home.